Hey what's up guys welcome to find gap youtube channel and in today's video i will teach you how to implement javascript auto generate password feature in this video we will code a complete function by ourselves that will generate a random password for our users so without any delay let's start so first of all here you can see that i will create an input here and then i will give an id to this so i can access this element in my javascript i will give id like my input and next after this i will create a button here and give text to it like generate password next give an attribute to this button on click is equal to double quotation and on click of this button we will generate we will call a function here like generate password I will copy this next after this button I will create a script tag so we can write our JavaScript here and here I will type this function name before this make sure to type here function space because we declare a function with function keyword in JavaScript next what we need to do first of all I will copy this input and paste here and type here and next type here document dot get element by ID single quotes and paste this id here basically this complete uh, input element will be saved in our this my input variable and next after this i will create another variable like characters and inside this i will type some character here for example the symbols one two three four so make sure to type here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and next similarly we will type some alphabet characters and similarly i will type here alphabet characters in uppercase next after this i will create a for loop here and inside this i will create a variable i zero and next i will type here i less than here we have to declare an other variable like var length is equal to currently i'm just going to type here eight so basically our this function will generate password up to eight characters so just i will type here i less than length and similarly make sure to press i plus plus otherwise our loop will run for infinite times next type here next we need a javascript function that will generate a random number for ourselves so in google from here i will type this function copy this open the vs code studio and paste here and basically here you can see that here they have typed maximum so i just type here like six or 70 so why I type here 70 here you need to write the exact words that your string have I am just assuming that for example our this string have 70 characters so I'm typing here 70 if you if you have a string which have only 20 characters 50 characters you have to type that specific number at this position here I will type here variable random number I will store this random number in a variable called random number and next we need to create another variable here like password in which we will save our actual password and after this you, you you just need to type here password and plus equal to type here correct charts means our this variable in which we have saved these characters and next type here big brackets and inside this i will copy and paste this random number here so suppose first time when this loop will run and for example this function will run and uh, suppose it create 35 as a random number in this variable and in this line we are just saying that in character string just get the 35th number of characters so, suppose maybe this is the 31st uh, 35th character so it will just save this character as a first character of our password so that's what this line will do similarly in the end we just need to copy this my input which is our input field dot value is equal to password just save and refresh and let's see what happened so friends here you can see that our this button is generating a password for ourselves so similarly if you want a big password like for 16 words you can type here now you can see that our this function will generate a password of uh, 16 characters so friends i hope you must enjoy this video if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos and finally, thanks for watching.